Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am the wizard and today I got a fresh hot off the press drama alert news story for you all. But before we jump into that, I'm going to ask you to keep all your hands and feet inside the vehicle, buckle your seatbelt and click that subscribe button above so you don't miss any more content from myself here on my channel. But without further ado, let's jump right in to the drama alert video for today. And what we got going on, it involves Optic Hex and the second Optic team that was just recently formed this week. So, first things first, we are going to have to rewind to PAX East 2014 where I reunited with my man Zevadar. Link down below, check him out. And we were at the MLG Turtle Beach booth at PAX East. It was really cool, a lot of, uh, met a lot of cool people, made some connections, handed out tons of business cards, all that good stuff. But anyways... We met up with Optic Hex, or we introduced ourselves to Optic Hex. I was asking about YouTube, Drama Alert, Keemstar, everything that surrounds the gaming community as a whole. We had a great conversation, and then I popped the question. I go, Hex, why are you so against having a second Optic team? And he broke it down essentially like this, that by having two teams, it would not only spread out the team too far, but it would also like water down the core, almost family-like values and connection that the Optic team has already established so far by living together in the Optic house. I agreed with all that, and the way I kind of interpreted it was like the Roman Empire, where you take a great thing and expand it so far and so wide that it eventually collapses on itself, and I think that's something that uh, any professional MLG team would like to avoid, having their team just absolutely shit on themselves. Um, and I was like, Hex, that's all great points, a smile for the camera, we took a picture, shook his hand, and went on my day at PAX. I was like, oh, okay, wow, that's really cool. Hex made some great points. I'm really glad I talked to him and met him. Uh, and I just carried on, went to school the next day, got home, checked Twitter, and what do you know? There's a second Optic team. So first thing that went to my mind was, what happened? Did M. Bose say something that changed his mind and got his own team? Because that's what happened. M. Bose now is the leader of the second Optic team. Uh, did Hex just lie to me? What happened? I'd want to know. I want to leave it up to you guys. What do you think is the story behind the second Optic team? All I know is that I was fed false information by Hex when he said that he would never ever make a second Optic team and he gave me reasons. I agreed. You know my story. What do you think happened? Sound off in the comments down below. I'll read and respond to anything that's relevant. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, Wizard out.